Hey, what is up, guys? It's Biscuit Rebellion, and welcome to my infamous walkthrough, which might be my last one because we finally get to meet and face Kessler. Well, I'm not sure because, damn, I never finished the game. So I think the only part that I got up to without doing a walkthrough and with just me playing for fun, I think it was from here to where Olden was. I never got past the Kessler part only because I didn't feel like playing it. But now. This is starting to get real interesting. Now we get to meet Kessler eye to eye. Oh, yes. It's about freaking time. Whoa. Isn't that where the blast radius was? That was where the blast radius was. That's crazy. Yeah, I can see the mission log right there. Wow. How ironic. <laughs> and of course, it has to be where Cole was knocked out the first time the blast happened. Wow. That's even more ironic, but, but come on, let's go. And here we are, back where it all started. I was so worried that you weren't going to live through the blast. But you were fine. More than fine, actually. I remember your voice now. You were there after the bomb went off. I've always been there, Cole. Every step of your life. Great, now he can teleport. That is a power I've been dying to get since it was first invented. Ooh. Wanna play like that? Damn it. Oh, what the hell? My god, this guy can teleport like it's freaking nothing. <laughs> How does this guy know, even know the main character's mother? Seriously. What the hell? We got a stalker here. You almost got me there. You're not going anywhere. I wasn't trying to go anywhere. Why, you little bitch. You're all you got. I'm gonna need more juice. Ah, there we go. Where do you think you're going? What the hell, man? What power does this guy have? Electricity? Yes, he does. And for some reason he has earth powers too, because I see the ground rumbling. You're not warming your way out this time, Kessler. Come on, I'm tapping it, I'm tapping it. A failure. All of this has been for nothing. Ah! Now he got my face. Doesn't concern you, fat man. Ah! Zeke, I really appreciate it, but save you this time. Come on. You're not gonna be so glib when I land my foot up your ass. Enough with the teleportation. That is a very annoying power. Oh, ran out of juice. Damn it. I need more juice myself. Damn it. Whoa. This Shit. Nothing cold. What's coming is much, much worse. You almost got me. You gotta admit that. Come on, come on, show me what you got. Crap. Oh, 
crap. Oh crap. Ha! You almost got me. I messed up once again. Crap. Find electricity. Ah! Die. How did I miss that? Uh, there we go. Whoa. Ha! You almost missed me. I said you. I said uh, I almost missed him. Whoa. Need electricity. Oh great. I hate these guys. Old man carried a picture of Trish in his wallet, telling people she was the daughter he never had. Did you know that? He couldn't wait for you to marry her. Rotten son of a bitch. How does this guy even know all this information? Oh, you missed me. Almost got him, almost got him. Fine. Oh, crap. Oh, I thought he was going to shoot me for a minute. Oh, thank God. Crap. Got him now. Let's go. Ooh, he got me. Wow. Gotta give the gotta give the guy credit. And he got me again. I hate these guys more than anything at this point. <laughs> now I can't reach them. What the hell? Come on. There we go. Ooh, almost got it. What the hell? Oh, hell no. Now I'm gonna get you. Get him! Punch his shit! Die! Mm. Finally! I looked down at Kessler, reveling in my victory. And then I heard him whisper, Trish, I love you. Please forgive me. Then he was on me. What the hell? Fingers digging into my face. As Kessler's secrets played out in my head, I finally began to understand. I saw his nemesis, a beast intent on extinguishing all life. In those early days, Kessler could have used his powers to stop it, but instead he fled with his family, leaving others to fend for themselves. Hunted for years, Kessler and his family watched as the rest of the world went to hell. And then it was too late, too late to fight. Too late to save anyone. 
in that moment of failure and grief, he used his newest and most dangerous power. He went on a one-way trip back in time, attempting to rewrite history. Kessler seized control of the First Sons and accelerated the race sphere's development. Decades spent plotting the blast, organizing the quarantine, finding me. Yet the thing that drove him forward, Kessler's sole link to the past, was a picture from his wedding day. Whoa! He married Trish, with Zeke as his best man. My brain lurched, unable to accept that Kessler and I were the same person. That he'd come back in time to mold me into the savior he failed to be. Going so far as to kill the woman he loved, I loved, so that I wouldn't be tied down by emotions. No, Kessler wanted me strong, ruthless, so that when I faced the beast, I'd be capable of making impossible decisions. All for the common good. And then Kessler fell back, dead. His final message, my final message, burned into my brain. I take one last look down at myself, my future self, and turn away. The rage curdling inside. I hate everything about Kessler. But when the time comes, I will be ready. Wow. I feel so mindfuck now. <laughs> Did not expect that. Wow. That was real messed up. Did not expect that. Jesus Christ. Whoa, what's going on? That was going on to my TV. Oh. Pff. For like a split second, I really actually thought that my <laughs> TV was going haywire. Is there any way I can skip this? No, I cannot. Well, guys, that is the end of the infamous walkthrough. Hope you guys enjoy. Expect to see part two probably later on. I think next week. And by part two, I mean Infamous 2, because I do have Infamous 2 right now. But expect to see that next week. Anyway, this is Biscuit, and I am signing off, because I'm finally done with the freaking game. It's about time to. Peace out, and have a nice day. Bye.